And it's now time for Jake's Takes here on the Washington Huddle. Jake Seeley from RotoExperts.com. Good enough to join us every single week, one of the top experts in the country. So, Jake, we got to start off with the rematch. This week it's the Eagles and the Redskins, Monday Night Football. We got to talk about the quarterbacks again, Cousins versus Wentz. It was Wentz that got the better of the two last time. What do you see in the second matchup? I think we're going to see better results from Kirk Cousins as we've seen of late. So I think that both of them need to be in your lives. Carson Wentz is he's having his breakout season. And I think what you're looking for here is that Kirk Cousins continues the recent trend of starting to up, basically get his play back on track, have some more connection with the receivers. I mean, it's going all the way down the line. And Chris Thompson has been a great find for this team and really opening up that offense. One of your biggest talking points throughout the whole season has been. The Redskins receivers talking about Terrell Pryor, about Josh Doxson, Jameson Crowder. They haven't really done what you'd expected them to. So where did they go from here? What do you expect in this game? Unfortunately, and I hate to say this to Redskins fans out there, but Jameson Crowder is droppable in fantasy leagues at this point. Something's not right. I don't know if maybe it's not 100%. I'm just speculating because we saw what he was with this team last year, and something's not clicking. Terrell Pryor, the problem with this offense, too, is it's a timing precision based, and he's very raw, still in his route running, so he's not getting open for Kirk Cousins, a precision passer. And if you look at it, now we're seeing Ryan Grant, and we're seeing Josh Doxson, and that's who I want to keep eye on for the second half of the season. He could end up pushing his way into that number one role by the end of the year. What can you say about Chris Thompson, though? He's been this guy that has just emerged in the last couple of weeks. He's a must-start in fantasy. He's been the most consistent and best option. for. The, he's on pace for 100 receptions and 1,000 receiving yards as a running back. And if you're talking fantasy this week, you can't go anywhere else but the quarterback. There's one named Aaron Rodgers who could be out for the year. That's, that has to, has, has to have a ripple effect here. It's painful, and there's not a whole lot you can do. You obviously, you want to look for trades. Maybe you can get Matt Ryan, who's not playing as well as he did last year. You can get him cheap. Trade for Derek Carr, same thing. He's got a tough schedule. If you're looking to the waiver wire, it's really thin. Your best option is maybe Terrell Pryor, who's playing the Buccaneers this week. Another big injury on the NFL front. And in fantasy, he's Jake Seeley from RotoExperts.com. He joins us every week here on the Washington Huddle. And now we go inside the huddle with Brian Parsons.